When did you know you wanted to be a labor and delivery nurse? And at this point, about how many babies have you delivered? I've wanted to be a labor and delivery nurse since I was in sixth grade, which I know sounds crazy, but it's been that long. I've been a labor and delivery nurse for two and a half years. I've probably delivered a solid 500. Hola, mi nombre es Melissa Oeser, es enfermera para hoy. How do you feel being a Spanish-speaking Latina has impacted your work? It's one of the primary reasons why I went into healthcare. Uh, you don't see a lot of Spanish-speaking providers, whether it's doctors or nurses. I wish we made nursing school and med school more accessible to the Hispanic population. My nursing program, there were only three of us who spoke Spanish in my cohort. I work with 80 nurses. Uh, I'm one of the two that are fluent in Spanish. There's a huge Hispanic population in the U.S and it's much needed. It makes all the difference in the world. And I've buried the lead here a bit because I know you personally, you were my labor and delivery nurse with my son, Maximo. I love stepping into my room and meeting a patient and just vibing with him immediately. And I remember being in your room for so long. I remember going back and forth and speaking in Spanish and English and then talking about food and then where our families were from. And then I step out and it's always at the nurse station where we're like, oh my God, we love our patient. And I remember like calling my parents after work. There's just like a level of comfort and I don't know, it brings me back to home. Do you feel like you're making a difference in your community? Absolutely. Absolutely, yeah. People always joke, they're like, oh, you're the only person I know who said they wanted to do something in middle school and you're doing it and you love it. And I'm really proud to say that I followed my dreams and I'm accomplishing that and I see myself being a bedside nurse for a very long time.